Hi, I'm Difex, and today we're going to be making a down filter sound. And how we're going to achieve this is we are going to layer our sound right here with some white noise. I'll play the sound for you guys really quick. So we're going to layer our white noise with that, record it in Edison, bounce it out, throw it in the noise tab in Serum. And I'll also have the link in the description for this sound and the finished sound in Serum. And I particularly don't have a set way on how I do this. I'll do different things each time just to get different results because I don't always want it to come out the same. So you guys should do the same. Follow along, learn, and try different techniques. Don't do exactly what I do because you guys are going to want to get different stuff each time you do this so make sure you play around and experiment it never hurts okay so let's jump into this so we're gonna go to our noise tab just to get our our white noise and what I'm using is the air can 4 you can find it right here in organics so I basically made an 8 bar MIDI clip of it in the piano roll. We're going to play both together really quick. So we're going to record both of these guys. So let's do that really quick. Oh, another thing. Make sure you go on here. I don't know. You guys might be set on on input or now or input. Make sure you go on play. Hit the record button. And press play. What a great annoying sound. <laughs> okay, so double click on this, right click, edit, and delete. And then we'll drag this guy onto our playlist. Let's get rid of these guys just for right now. So this is the next step. Putting it in Serum. So we're going to open up our Serum. We're going to go to Menu. Show Serum Preset Folder. And it just opened up on my second monitor. Here, let me drag this over there. Okay, there we go. So you're going to want to go like this somehow and it'll still be open the serum preset folder we're gonna go to noises and we can go to analog or organics it doesn't matter wherever you want to put it I'm gonna put it in analog I'm gonna double click on this guy our sound we're gonna drag it into here So we're going to rename it as well so we don't get lost. Cool. So it's named. We can close that now. Open this back up. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to delete Serum. So it registers that you put it in there. If you don't, you won't see it in the noise tab. So make sure you delete it and reopen it. All right. So we're going to go to the noise tab. And we're going to click on here, go to analog, and then here's our down filter. So this is what we have. Oh, oops. Make sure you turn oscillator A off. <laughs> so there's that sound. Our sound right here. Make sure you turn the volume up as well. So we're going to make our LFO go up like this. Go to trigger. And then go to two bars. You can do four bars if you want. I think I'm going to do four. We're just going to, I'm going to experiment and just see what we can get. 
So let's put it right here. And let's see. So that would be an uplifter. We want it the opposite way. That's too much. So I think we're going to go polar instead of unipolar. And how you do that is shift alt click and that'll go to polar. And you could do the same to go to unipolar. Unipolar polar. Okay. So let's try it this way. So that's basically what we want. Cool. So now we're going to add some effects. can add like flanger and phase and course whatever you want I'm just gonna play around add some shit multi-band compression and always reverb reverb is your best friend We might turn down this distortion because I'm kind of hearing this crackly sound. Might take a little of the low end out as well by going like this. Maybe around 250 hertz. Coolio. And also, I think we can add the oscillator A just for some tonality. And I don't know what wavetable we should pick. Let's see. Do a saw rounded. So we're going to add this up to here. That's the wrong way. a little tonality let's see what else we can do we can put a ramp on there or not a ramp remap sorry I always think it's called ramp excuse my retardedness I'm just kidding <laughs> Also turn up the unison some. Okay, we're starting to get somewhere. So next we're gonna add another LFO. And I'll kind of give it some movement. We'll also do that with the filter. Actually, maybe we'll put LFO1 on the filter. 
So let's play with some filters and see what we get. Who knows what could happen? Put an LFO two on there as well. do is we can like make that start off really fast and get slower uh, uh, excuse me by going to our matrix let's see if I can remember how to do this correctly I think we start with LFO 1 and then go to the LFO2 rate. And then we just kind of pitch this up. Let's see. Okay, so that's kind of opposite. It's kind of going faster the more it goes up. So, think how we can achieve this is doing what we did here but with LFO 3 let's go like that and I think that was four bars yeah four bars okay so yeah we'll do LFO 3 and now it should do that oh yeah make sure you go and trigger too so there we go that's the effect we want and we can kind of play with this It'll make it go like slower or faster. I think the higher you go up, it's going to go faster. Yeah. So we want it a little slower than what it was at. this a little more oh we also want to turn this on on the noise so this affects the noise Totally forgot about that. Let's 
So that's basically our sound. I think we're done. I mean, you guys can always add more if you want. Kind of take these techniques and do it in your own ways. If some of you guys don't already know how to do this. Some of you seasoned pork chops out there. <laughs> so let's see what we got. So yeah, there you guys have it. There's the sound. We're all done here. I'll make sure to have the link in the description to where you guys can download the sound and this sound right here if you want to completely recreate what I did. And if you guys like what I'm doing here, go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, dislike, whatever the fuck you want to do. I don't give a shit. <laughs> And there will be more videos in the future. I'll probably do some bass videos here soon. But anyways, you guys all have a great day. Take it easy. Peace and love to all.